an interesting way of dealing with litter bugs. They've launched a campaign where they're going to plaster your face on a bus stop or a billboard if you litter. So let's take a look at this video to find out more about this exciting campaign. <laughs> Yeah. Get a DNA sample, recreate your face, and put it um, on a billboard. Here's my message. problem with this whole thing. They showed the lab where the guy was doing like the whole face recognition thing and everything. It was a white guy working in the lab. Now, white guys have been notorious for saying that all black people look the same, all Asian people look the same. So he's the one producing this face. How do we know that he's not putting the same face for everyone out there, like the same face for every single crime out there? He's putting it on that billboard. I, I, I'm just mm. amazed at the amount of time <laughs> <laughs> that they have to walk around <laughs> with little clippings <laughs> and pick up cigarette buds. Mm. You, you know, I, I'm amazed. And then they are going to run your DNA. It's going to take a couple of days. Um, so I just want to know, while they're doing that, who is... Uh, taking care of actual crime mm -hmm. being committed. <laughs> well, I figured they've, you know? <laughs> they've already like sorted out the problem. If they're going to go around and pick up all the trash, then the problem's solved. Why are we? You know? Yeah, they're <laughs> picking up the trash. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> good. And, then, and on top of, you know, things are probably like really good in Hong Kong at the moment if they can spend this much time and money on this. Like yeah. this is their biggest issue. Don't litter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah so we're we're up there. Name it shame for litter. <laughs> That's that's just beautiful. Why I'm is sorry, that? as a comic, I would want my face out on phone. <laughs> yeah, like, my show. <laughs> um, if you don't, I'm gonna drop this packet right here. <laughs> well, it's, and also, those are like the genetic um, projections of what they should look like. But if you have a beard and you've put on like 30 kilograms, you're not gonna exactly. So all the fat bearded men, they can just toss their litter about, and the rest of Shave us shave their face, and they'll be okay. Mm -hmm. no? I'm I'm shocked. It just it scares me to know that I might not be able to do anything anymore. Well, stop littering, Shami. Yeah, well, yeah. that's the first step, stop littering. Didn't you watch the ad? It could be your face. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm sorry, I was confused between the Terminator. Would this happen in South Africa? No, I yes. because South Africa has bus stops with Patricia De Lille on <laughs> saying that she has a drug problem. Nothing to do with littering. But that's fame. I mm. can't wait to be so famous that I have a drug problem poster. Anything. Um, that's, that's my goal. We day. will do anything mm. to get our faces <laughs> exactly. out there. I'll be the biggest what listener. What are you willing to do to get... Uh, I will I'll take stuff out the bin and start yeah. throwing it around. <laughs> exactly. But it's not, it's not exactly. all famous people. There's one in Weinberg. Um, by Weinberg Tax Rank. And it's just some random woman that says, my name is so-and-so and I live in Constantia. Not me. famous at all. Thanks. You don't live in Constantia, Kelly, and I know this. <laughs> we're in Hong Kong now. So, <laughs> we bring all, it back. We can all Hong do Kong. it. I'm sure all I'm are. saying is, yeah. the president in Hong Kong should not get so mad that he or she kicks over the track. <laughs> and <I'm> like, yeah. <laughs> well, if you kick over the trash can, they're not going to be able to tell it to you. You can always wear gloves if yeah. you're really like a serial literate, right? <laughs> 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 uh, Jack but the Litterer. I mean, <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is concerning for me. I, I'm really concerned by the fact that the, the trash gets picked up, it gets put through like a laboratory. It, it's and who's serious. Paying for yeah, it's this is serious. Too much money. <laughs> I this am is serious. literally not phased. <laughs> I'm not phased. This, this, this is serious. I'm so concerned right now. How long would it take yeah, to pick up all the garbage oh here God. in Cape Town? <laughs> Wait, hold up. And by the way, is it is it recycle? Like, if you recycle. Um, no, it's stuff on the ground. Mm. Right? So no, but you see, they pick it up, right? Yes. Because Hong Kong is clearly very they they they, they, they like paranoid schizophrenia. You can say anal. Yeah. yeah, that too. <laughs> but my point is, so do they just put all the trash in one bag, or is it like birds with birds and like chips packets with chips packets? Like you know, isn't it all about trying to keep the earth clean and? So after they've done the DNA analysis, then they should recycle those bits. You know okay. what I'm saying? Fair, oh. fair enough. Fair okay, enough. I understand. Oh, after. was I just speaking French right now? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, oh, like, where was I? <laughs> but they were picking up cigarette butts and condoms. 
You can't really recycle that. I uh, hope not. <laughs> it's it's plastic. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, it's plastic. <laughs> you know? Okay.